it's just really a sad day that they would step to that point where they want to buy a seat, steal a seat or whatever they want to call it. The Beaumont School Board President criticizing opponents of the May election. He says the district is moving forward with plans for that election. Good evening, I'm Kelly Phillips. Thank you for joining us. The Beaumont School Board has voted to rescind the seven single member district map trustees approved in February. The board took the action during a special meeting this afternoon. Those who voted in favor of the move say it prepares the district for the May 11th school board elections. KFTM reporter Megan Diller joins us live from the administration building where the board just wrapped up today's special meeting. Megan. Well, Kelly, the board voted 5-2 in favor of going back to an old map, but not without a heated exchange, including one between the board president and a board member. You, you, you can't ask me to leave, Woodrow. Yes. I, 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 I got elected. Excuse me. I got elected the same. Board President Woodrow Reese and Trustee McNeil traded words this afternoon. The board voted to resend the seven single member map the group approved in February. In its place, the district will use a map the Justice Department pre cleared in 2001. Board members Tom Neal and Mike Neal voted against the move. They're concerned the board is breaking the law by using that map. They argue the most recent census numbers require a new map because of changes in population in the seven districts that make up the BISD boundaries. The district says it's the only map approved by the Justice Department at this point. That's the real issue, is that the, it's the map. It's not about, uh, you know, them being able to sign up because that was not, that's not an issue. And the board has a policy that, uh, that sets when, when their uh, elections are going to be filled. Missing the 90-day deadline is frustrating, especially when we can't even get our own attorney to admit that someone should have circled that date on the calendar. I mean, she says that we did, she didn't advise us of that in, in February because she was busy, but she's been advising us for two years in the whole process. Both BISD attorney Melody Chappelle and trustee Mike Neal agree the district is back to square one with the map pre-cleared in 2001. The attorney who may sue the district was not at this afternoon's meeting.